San Diego County's unemployment rate jumped to 8% after the governor's latest shutdown order. Our ABC 10 News reporter John Horn explains why getting our unemployment numbers back down once restrictions ease, that may not be that simple. The chef right there, this is Chef Jonathan Freiberg. Chef Freiberg is one of just three employees remaining at Lucadia's Valentina restaurant. At the beginning of December, its staff was almost 30. Not only as a manager of the location, it's also tough as, as a person to, to have to tell 26 people hey, uh, you're not going to get a paycheck for the next foreseeable future. Restaurant manager Ricardo Zarate Jr. delivered that bad news after Governor Gavin Newsom's new coronavirus shutdown order went into effect. The order limited restaurants to take out only, capped retail capacity at 20 percent, and forced salons to close as ICU capacity hit zero in Southern California. Valentina and employers across our region cut jobs in the wake of the governor's shutdown order. In fact, new numbers from the state show that the region's unemployment rate jumped from 6.6% in November to 8% in December. The state numbers also show that in 2020 as a whole, San Diego employers shed more than 105,000 jobs, about half of which came from restaurants, bars, and hotels. Those jobs likely not coming back until after massive vaccine distribution. Again, some, some businesses have, have closed uh, their doors of, uh, for good and they'll eventually be replaced, but it takes a while then for, for, for businesses to, 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 uh, to do that. As long as the order stays in effect, we will continue to comply. Zarate Jr. says he's waiting for the green light with 26 workers on speed dial. John Horn, ABC 10 News.